This year we lost a very special man, Gino Ojic. Not only was he special to the Vancouver Canucks organization and the city of Vancouver, he was a champion of the Musqueam Golf and Learning Academy, the Musqueam First Nations Band, and the special needs community. There he is. Connor McDavid? Connor who? Hey. So so what did you say about Connor? He, he might forget about the hockey game. Oh, I don't think he will. He might think it in the afternoon. <laughs> <laughs> no, it's not tomorrow night. He oh, I get mixed up on the time. Should I phone him? Give him, give him a wake up call? Yeah. <laughs> Tank was born ready.
Come on, Casey. Not only did Gino Ojic fight for his Vancouver Canuck teammates, he fought for issues and people that mattered to him. Gino was a kind, giving human being. His legacy is more than just being a tough NHL hockey player. It's only fitting that his ashes be laid to rest in something that was as beautiful as he was. Thanks to Musqueam carving artist Jody Sparrow, he is. The world will not be the same without you, Gino. You will always be the first star to us. A very wise person once said to me, you never know how far your light shines. Sometimes you don't realize the impact and how much you touch people. Gino, your light was bright to a lot of people. Rest in peace, Gino.